All right. Hello and welcome everyone. Yep, good afternoon. We trust you're all doing well. Yes, absolutely. Yeah, and uh, uh, we're trying something a little bit different here. we on the gimbal and the other side of the house. And uh, um, yeah, Father, we thank you for your glory. We thank you for your love. We thank yeah. you for your power. We thank you for your, for your, sorry about that. We thank you for your glory, Lord, and everything that we do. We thank yeah. you that that you are truly the King of Kings Amen. and the Lord of Lords. Amen. Thank you for the for the for for the privilege, Lord, of mm. of 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 partnering with you in the kingdom. Absolutely. Thank you for the privilege, Lord, of of seeing your hand in our lives, Lord, in yeah. a great and a powerful way. Amen. You are truly worthy of all praise and honor, yes. Father. And um, and we just want to thank you for everything that you've given us, Lord, Absolutely. King of Kings, Lord of Lords. Yeah. Amen. 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 Babe, you want to sit back a bit or slightly? Yes. You're, you're kind of, there we go. your head looks massive. <laughs> so, yeah, I, I just, I think in light of the fact, so for those of you who have joined us yeah. um, for uh, fasting today, yeah. we are fasting for our country, yeah. our beloved yes. country yeah. um, that we are trusting so much for and already yeah. I see a major feat. Yeah. So Monday there was a planned shutdown come on um, the national yeah, shutdown yeah, yeah, and there yeah. was a whole lot of fear amen and intimidation yes. that was um, yes, yes. around that mm -hmm. and we just want to say thank you to our thank you jesus friends overseas yeah. uh, i saw pre-meetings yeah. that were happening in new zealand yeah a room full yeah. of mighty men standing yes. holding hands come on there was probably about 40 of them yeah in yeah. room and uh, yes. that, that's connected to the Eason family yeah. so um we're just so grateful that they were they were standing with us yeah and outside of that i think that the the church mm -hmm. was mobilized yeah come on and um you know beginning of last week I, yes. I felt the intimidation tactics of the enemy and trying to mess with my mind yeah. Yeah. mess with my psyche my yeah. my peace trying yes. to rob yeah. my, personally yeah. my peace my joy yeah um regarding the situation and so what well, what do we do about something like that what do we what do we do well we we're called to pray and come on you would remember Amen. last week we chatted well i was it was me and um just chatting about pray yeah. as if somebody's life depends yeah. on it and that was testimony come of on. my friends our friend's son who was involved in a motorbike accident and yeah. having prayed for that well i tell you friends i believe that we prayed as if our country's come on yeah. life depended yeah, on it very good and very um good. yeah so we that is what we did we prayed mm -hmm. and the lord was yeah. faithful on come sunday on. i mentioned um from a book of uh, from rt kendall and he, he says that john kennedy used to say there's a huge problem and the the problem is is that life is not fair yeah. and one of the reasons why something is not fair is because people in power people um uh, you know, presidents of country, people who have got they carry a lot of weight in terms of being able to make decisions. Yeah. Only a very small minority can access those people. Yeah. And um, uh, not the majority. No, not the masses. Yeah. So they get to make these life-changing decisions. And on Sunday, we were just saying about the fact that actually we have access to one yeah. who is far more superior. Yeah, yeah. And he he holds far greater weight. Come and, on. And, and he listens to us. Mm, come on. And we work in partnership with Very him. Very good. Very and good. And we saw that with Monday. Yeah, come uh, on. You know, just waking up on the day, you know, I just I had to do some business with God. Like I said early last week, just being actually physically starting to get fearful. Yeah. And... Um, just had to do some business with God and say, look, Lord, I got to trust you in this area because mm. I, I need to breed trust. Yeah. Because yeah. when I'm going to speak to people, already on Sunday, I had people, uh, someone grip me and pray for the riots, pray for the looting, you know, and and, and just speaking peace, yeah. you know, speaking Very His good. power, Very good. His supremacy over the situation. Yeah. And here we sit. It was a peaceful day. Literally Very in the good, morning, man. it was a yeah. glorious day. Excellent. Like there was a tangible, just changed one of my neighbors. Yeah. She said she even felt there was just a peace. It was Come beautiful. On. Come on. So it was, a, a, and, and, and we sit here victorious Amen. after this. Amen. So Lord, we thank you for that. Mm -hmm. We thank you, Lord, that that, that whole Amen. shutdown thing was just a wet mm -hmm. squid, yeah. as I told my kids the other night. Wet squib, Lord. Mm -hmm. 
that uh, there was not much that happened there and we just thank yeah. you lord for your hand mm -hmm. on this country father yeah. lord we thank you that you, that you, that you bless yeah. this country with your mm -hmm. power that lord you have blessed this country with your grace and your love lord and we pray that you'd continue to pour out your spirit upon mm -hmm. us in a powerful, powerful mm -hmm. way. Lord, thank you for the thousands and thousands of churches that are praying yes, for this country, amen. Lord. That they're praying, Father, thank for you, the glory yeah. of this country, Lord. Mm -hmm. Praying that you would, you, Lord, would, yeah. would uh, um, expose corruption yeah. and bring your justice mm -hmm. because you're a good God. Amen? amen. So, Father, we thank you for that. We thank you, Lord, for our education, Lord. We thank you for the criminal justice system, mm -hmm. Lord, the criminal system, the police, the metro, Father. We pray for all the provinces that you would do a powerful thing, Lord, that you would expose corruption in, in, its, in all its forms and facets, Father God, in yeah. every area in this country, and you would bring your justice in Jesus' yeah. mighty name, God. Yeah. Yeah. Only you can, Lord. As we said many times, friends, that, uh, that we, we can, uh, you know, we can do what we can, but we can uh, petition the one who has the power to bring about change. Amen. Amen. And he has the power to bring about change, and that is our Father in heaven. Amen. And so we ask our Father, Lord, we thank you that you are the one who can expose corruption, Father, in this city. Thank you for the trials that are happening already in this city for, for, for former leaders of this city who, were, who are alleged to be corrupt. And there are trials that are going on, Father God. We pray for good outcomes in these mm -hmm. trials. Mm -hmm. We thank you, Lord, that you'd expose corruption mm -hmm. from, from the upper echelons of government right down to the lowest echelons, yeah. Father, that you would expose yeah. corruption and bring about your justice yeah. in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Father, we just thank you that... Uh, nefarious yeah. plans were yeah. brought to naught in yeah. Jesus' name. Amen. That, Amen. So that you, your peace prevailed, yes. Lord God. And we believe yeah. that it was because of the power of prayer. Very good. There were we mm. we were mm. not mm. caught unawares, yeah. Yeah. and your bride. Yeah. We operated with Very you. Very good. And and we thank you, Father. Amen. That your peace prevailed. Come on. Uh, I woke up yesterday morning. A scripture had been sent through to my phone. Yeah. And uh, it's from Isaiah 32, and it says. See, a king will reign in righteousness, mm, mm, and mm. rulers will rule Come with on. justice. Very good. Uh, each one will be like a shelter from the wind and a refuge from the storm, oh, come like on streams of water in the desert yeah. and the shadow of a great rock in a thirsty land. Imagine wow. leaders like that. Yeah. Yeah. And then it says, the eyes of those who see will no longer be closed. The yeah. ears of those who hear will listen. The fearful Very heart good. will know and understand. Mm. The stammering tongue will come be on. fluent and clear. Come and then on. it Beautiful. continues on to say this. No longer, this is verse 3 from Isaiah 32. Yeah. No longer will be the will the fool be called noble, nor the scoundrel be highly respected. Yeah. For fools speak folly. Their hearts are bent on evil. They practice ungodliness mm. and spread error concerning the Lord, mm, mm, the mm. hungry, and they leave empty. And from the thirsty, they withhold water. Very good. Scoundrels yeah, yeah. use wicked methods. Yeah. They make up evil schemes yeah, to destroy good, the poor with lies, even when yeah, the plea of that. the needy is just. Very good. But, verse 8, the noble make noble plans and by noble mm, deeds mm. they stand. Come on. So, Father, we release Amen. noble Amen. people Amen. Amen. into government yes. and into rulership yes, Lord. and into yes, dominion Jesus. over our country. Amen. Amen. In Thank Jesus you, Father. Name. Do this, Lord. People that have noble yes. hearts, yes. full of justice. Amen. Full of righteousness, Amen. Amen. deep conviction, yes, God. where they cannot, Thank you, Lord. they cannot tolerate mm. anything that is not not right. Yeah. Where they just have a cutting edge conviction, yeah, where they just good. know they know good from evil, yeah. and yeah. Uh, and and yeah. darkness from light. Amen. And and they yes, would God. operate in those ways. In Jesus, yes, Jesus. Name. Thank you, Father. Yeah. Yes, Lord. We pray, Father. Even the education system, Lord, where yes. where where there's where there's just nefarious things going on, Lord, that you would. You, by your power, would bring your glory, would bring your justice, God. Yeah. That you would expose, yeah. Father, all the nefarious deeds of nefarious people, Lord. Evil people in positions of power. That you would expose them for who they are, Lord. Yeah. That you would expose them for yeah. who they are. Yeah. Right now, expose them, Father. Even on the bluff, Lord, where there's in, people in education, God, where there's nefarious things going on, Father, where there's schmockling with finances going on, that you would expose yeah, that in yeah, Jesus' name. Yeah. Expose it, God. Yeah. Expose it, Lord. Bring it back. Bring the righteous to the top Amen. and bring down Amen. the unrighteous and ungodly who Amen. seek to use 
finances, God, to manipulate yeah. and control yeah. and, and, you, and cause problems, Father. We thank you for men of, and women of integrity yeah. who will use those things as the tools that you've given us to use, Lord, yeah. to bring about change in this yeah. community yeah. and in this city. In Jesus' name, yeah. do this for your glory, God. Yeah. Thank you, Father. Yeah, we pray yeah. for the learners and the students mm, come on. that their education yeah. would be of top priority come on. within the schools. In Jesus' name, Amen. that it would be fiercely protected, yeah. fiercely prized, yeah. and come fiercely on. guarded. Mm. That it, where Woo. there has been a decline, there would be an increase, and it would be prized Very good. Very in good. such a radical way. Yeah. 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 Thank you, Lord. Yeah. Amen. We, Amen. We, 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 we choose not to live in a place of, of degeneration yeah. Thank you, Lord. and deterioration. Yeah. Thank you, Jesus. We want to live in a place of improvement, yeah. Very where good. we see things around us yeah. Very good. changing yeah. and improving in Jesus' yeah. name. Yeah, we're sitting on the back side of the house here where my, my daughter's, uh, um, well, back side of my house, we're sitting, it doesn't matter where we are, but we're outside my daughter's room here, and on her door, if I, if I go like that, it says, well, it says no entry, but I don't know what it says there now, it's backwards, but it says no entry, and so Father, we thank you that the Holy Spirit will put a no entry sign up, Ooh. Father God, in places where people are not supposed to go. Yeah. There will be a spiritual no entry sign Ooh, yes, that, that you, the Jesus. enemy will not be able to get into yes. because the Holy Spirit yeah. has stuck a sign there saying no entry Absolutely. because of the prayers of the saints. Yes. You know, interestingly, I was saying this to someone the other day, that, uh, um, that, uh, uh, that God was not happy with the Israelites because of something they had done. And he, he, he wanted to smite them. He was not happy with him, and there was there was something happening. And he said to Moses, "Pray for the people." And Moses prayed mm. for the people, and God changed his mind. Wow! And said, "Because you prayed, I won't do that." Mm. Our prayers, my friends, for some reason God wants to partner. For some reason, God wants to partner yeah. with His children, yeah. with His prayers, with His with His saints. And so we pray. Our prayers can essentially change the heart of God, yeah. change the mind mm. of God. Mm. Now we are under grace dispensation. He doesn't want to smite anyone. Amen. But at the end of the day, he can bring his justice yeah. when the prayers, when the saints pray. Yeah. And so we pray this morning, we pray this afternoon, rather, Lord, yeah. that you would do a powerful thing in yeah. this country, Father yeah. God. Lord, we read the news left and right. We read the news in the in the newspapers. We read the news in the in the news twenty four on the TV, Lord. We see the news on Facebook, Lord. We want to stand with faith. Yeah. Lord, we drive through the city. We can see the news. We can see things happening that are not supposed to be happening, or things that are not happening that should be happening mm -hmm. and father we pray a lot of that is happening because of people and their greed father when it comes to money expose corruption father we heard of the assassination of 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 guys to uh, a father and a son yesterday or monday father an assassination of high level people that are doing uh, um uh, curating and and uh, um, wrapping up of estates or not wrapping up estates lord curating for businesses that have gone under because because they they are being investigated father we pray that you would expose those who who, who uh, um who are causing these things to happen father god mm. expose the rot right down god expose yeah. the rot so that we can live in a country yeah. where we don't have rotten elements and high powers of position yeah. god yeah. expose it and bring justice father yeah. let's see people yeah. Put in prison mm. for these crimes, God. Yeah. No matter who they are yeah. and how high they are in government, Father. Yeah. And whatever government is in power, yeah. that you'd expose corruption and yeah. bring justice. Yeah. I, just the other day, I'm um, just Thank you, Jesus. operating in our garden a, a little yeah. while back yeah. uh, um, and doing some gardening. And there was like just a couple of weeds and a few things, and there just some stuff that was growing out of place. Yeah. And I just the Lord spoke to me through it and just said, "What are we tolerating?" Yeah, very good. What are we tolerating? Very good. Very good. There was an area where some rain yeah. water had yeah. um, gone down and washed away some sand, and yeah. I had to put some rubble in there just to build it up and pack it so it was, yeah. it was solid, and it wouldn't um, uh, make that area, um, you know, you you wouldn't fall if you stood yeah. in that area. Yeah. But it had to go from the ground up, and it was like, what are we tolerating? What things are, have been washed away? The the underground, those the oh, foundation stuff. So, Father, we stand and we say we will not tolerate mm, this any amen. longer. And we thank you for men and women who are going to step on the scene mm, that will not tolerate it either. Come they on, will beautiful. start to despise and detest these things yeah. and feel sick to their stomachs yeah. if they know that there are these type of plans happening. Very good. Thank, Thank you, Jesus. Jesus. We pray. Expose corruption, God. Mm -hmm. Expose corruption in the city, Father. Expose it. Let people be exposed by the power of God, not by the flesh of man. 
by the power of God. We pray, Lord, that you would enable the yeah. men and women to dig deep into the into places of darkness mm -hmm. and expose corruption for mm -hmm. what it is. And then, Lord, not just exposing, but bring about justice and change through that exposure. Let in your, Jesus' yeah, name. Let your light shine. Amen. Friends, we want to leave you with this. Tonight, we have Connie Hallowell um, at Grace Life. He is going to be talking through us through his his accident from 2019. He sent me a folder last night with a whole lot of photographs and some video stuff that's never been seen before. Well, not publicly anyway. It doesn't get seen publicly. Uh, it's stuff that he uses just for these talks. Let me tell you, you don't want to miss this. This is going to be amazing. Mm -hmm. And uh, we're going to put it up, of course, as he speaks through it and speaks us through the pictures and the video. But uh, I want to encourage you, make tonight 6.30. Mm -hmm. Free dinner. We're going to have some dinner together. We'll break our fast together. We're not going to pray. Don't, please don't wait for some of the leaders to come to pray. Just pray with each other. Break your fast when you get there and you start eating from 6.30. Pray with each other. Break your fast. Thank God for, for exposure of corruption. Thank you. Thank Him for, for, uh, uh, for releasing His justice. Mm. Thank God for everything yeah. that He is. Amen. Yeah. And we'll get cracking by 7 o'clock with Connie. It's welcome, open to all. Please, let's invite our family and friends. Uh, he's going to give such a, a wonderful, probably evangelistic slant on this about the power of God, the love of God, and, uh, um, and how amazing He is. Amen. Amen. Otherwise, Amen. bless you guys. And yeah, thank you for turning the yeah, tides. And yeah, just this morning, yeah. just, just in my quiet time, we are turning the tides. Amen. Amen. So what a wonderful, a wonderful time wonderful, in wonderful. history. Amen. Amen. Awesome. Bless you guys. Hope to see you soon. Chat Bye for now. Bye.